level, the slime's castle. This is one of the levels, well, you need eggs. First off, over here, if you do not have an egg yet, well, I hope you, you still save that power up from our very first uh, collecting jumping game. You save that, I really hope you do because we're, gonna, we're about to use it. So take your egg, and then we're gonna shoot that flower over there. And I just realized I could do this. What an idiot. Um, so apparently you do not need an egg. Alright, fine, fair enough. Alright, um, you see this weird slimy thing? You'll be using him a lot. First off, you're gonna use him to get up this way. You can always get that flower later on. You can always just flutter on over. You get your second flower, first off. There we are third. See what this this is Liza awaits us. We gotta skip rooms this way. But it's not a good thing to skip rooms. Uh I'm gonna do this. Ah, uh, darn. I wanted to save it at 25 stars. But it's okay, 23 stars will be fine. When you're done, you can come on this way. Actually, give me a moment here. I haven't discovered the pipe there yet. Alright, the pipe is not enough. Alright. Okay. Let's move on. Uh. Nothing in this my by the These blocks here, depending on the color it will rotate. So if it's green, it will rotate the green ones so that you can now jump on them. Before then it, it would, the other side was spikes. So what you what you really wanna do is to come over here because you have you need to change the red ones. You also can use eggs to your advantage by the way. The idea is you have to get over here. But, we also need the 100%. So, first off, we gotta use the button again. We gotta go get up there. Rotate that, and then we're gonna move on this way. And this will... Uh, complete your 30 stars. Just don't lose them and you'll be fine. Jump, jump, and get your red coins. You just want to push the pot over here. You're going to get yourself a key. You're going to need that key. You got red coins. I believe. Uh, we can do this. Then get yourself some more eggs. We already got everything we need, so we just gotta go to the eggs. We need a key. Let's enter the door. And this will take us to our final portion of the level. Okay. This thing over here will uh, run in the direction, if it hits a wall, it will just turn back. Alright, there's our checkpoint, and it's time we hit our first major scale boss. The only one we face in the fortress, that one's just a mini boss. Let's go! What does this have to do? Okay, this is very simple. Um, Alright. There's always something's gonna go giant or something's gonna go small. Once again. 
All right. All you gotta do right now is just maintain this your health. That is the hardest part about boss battles. And you can use the slimes to your advantage. Ah, no. If you don't get rid of it quick, it's gonna grow. But when you get, when you finish him, you've just beaten up, you've just beaten yourself another boss. Yes, All right, and that concludes the main course of World One. And I'm going to tell you guys something which I didn't want to leak it out, but I guess I'm going to force to be leaking it out anyway. Upon completing the castle, you've unlocked another world. Uh, no, what world? You've unlocked another level. And this level is crazy hard compared to all the other levels. Um, also one thing, uh, I, I don't show it on the annotation map, but after you complete, say, the entire game, you're gonna unlock more secret levels. These and, and uh, these levels are gonna be, I, I I believe they're gonna be pretty hard. So my annotation map will show the position of the, uh, was, as you can see here, my annotation map. Uh, I will put the secret level as bonus one because I want the uh, the the world over there to like progress. So it'll be one two and one two three, one two three four as the worlds get more complex and, and goes on from there. Um, so yeah, next up on our roster, extra one. Time to kill ourselves.